Well, I'm looking forward to hearing the new commission. I mean, I really pushed myself with this new piece, and um, I, I've tried a lot of new things, and I've tried pushing a lot of the things that are part of my musical language to new limits and new places. And I was inspired to do that because I got to know how accomplished this orchestra is. You know, just, just the level of musicianship and the beauty of the space where the premiere will happen. Um, and all of that inspired me tremendously. It's a funny thing, my, my surname is Sierra or Sierra, which anyone in the West knows means mountain range in Spanish. And um, yet I've spent all my life in coastal cities. I was born in Miami, spent many years in New York and even more years in London. Um, and all those places are really flat. <laughs> I think anyone who comes to the West from somewhere else, and, and also for me as an American living in Europe, everything in Europe is very old and compact. And you come out to the West and everything is so grand and so spread out and there's so much space. As a composer, that, the sense of scale and distance and form and just trajectory of music is really essential to what we do. You know, anything that turns that sensibility upside down, like trying to walk across Antelope Island, for example, <laughs> um, is a great experience. You, you need your perspective jumbled up a little bit. When I was a young person, I didn't know there were living composers. I only really discovered that when I went to college. And, um, you know, to have a chance to be part of this organization that's really in in tune with its community and really connects to every part of the community. Uh, you know, it, I, I wish every music organization could do that.